Yo, what's up, guys, and welcome back to the What's Good podcast between Simon and myself. Woo! Woo! And if you're wondering why my voice is like this, it's because, number one, I'm hungover. Yeah. so is Simon. Yeah. Number two, I'm probably still a little bit drunk. I'm not. Simon's not. Uh, could be. Nah. Uh, because we came straight back from Vic Stag. <laughs> Your voice is gone. My voice actually is gone. <laughs> it actually is gone. Also, we're 75,000 follow subscribers <laughs> Fuck. away from one million. Yeah. So please subscribe. And if we do get a million, then... We will... We'll leak uh, the nudes that we took of Vic on the stag. I was going to say a similar kind of thing. Really? What were you going to say? I won't say what I was going to say. Okay. Because I shouldn't have said it. Oh. Okay. But I didn't. Yeah, we we took pictures of Vic's penis. And we'll leak Fucking them. hell, it's massive. Yeah. For it's, a small man. I heard that he was like 60 kilograms, by the way. I'm not sure if, that, if that's public knowledge. He lost a lot of weight when yeah, he was yeah. ill. But I reckon like literally five kilograms of that is his cock. Uh, Yeah, we had to use a panorama panoramic photo to, to get it all in which way is a photo taken doesn't matter we just had to fucking do this so it's wide it's everything damn um <laughs> actually, I'm actually, I'm literally i'm literally right now thinking of vic's dick <laughs> that, is, that is fantastic not in a weird way just in like because you brought it up I didn't, I didn't bring it up you were gonna say anyway i was gonna say someone else anyways uh yeah we literally just got back about we we landed about three hours ago yeah so it's funny because we were gonna originally fly to an airport. I can say that that was close to the podcast studio. Yeah, or closer. Well, we we're gonna fly into London. Yeah, yeah, and then we ended up not flying into London, so it's fine. <laughs> well, yeah, Randolph came to my house for the first time ever. I did. Well, he, he's been before, but not. I went. Went. Well, well, well. <laughs> yeah, as a, I, I just, just, just fuck. <laughs> <laughs> There's gonna be a lot of that today. There's gonna be a lot of that because I um I came to your house as it was being like built, not mm. built, refurbished. So like yeah. Shit was everywhere, but it, I got a didn't nice have a dog. It. Didn't have a dog. No, um, didn't have a stand a hit a hit handrail on, on the on the steps. You're step. struggling. <laughs> <laughs> it would have been worse if we came straight from the airport. Oh yeah, hundred percent. We had a bit of a break in a shower, not together, but although we, we did share toilet roll. We no, you make it sound like I wiped, then you wipe. <laughs> I just ripped off a lot of pieces of paper and gave him the rest. We, uh, he, he was coming out of his bedroom. I was coming out of my, the spare room. And um, we were like, walking to the main bathroom the together. Spare bathroom, yeah. He's like, wait, why are you here? <laughs> I was like, I need toilet roll. We have no toilet roll in the house. Yeah. Anyway, we're getting sidetracked. Your house, sick. Thank you. And Tyler done a great job. She has. Of like decorating it. Because I also realized that everything was like green. It's got a tint of green. Yeah. I loved that. The, the, the tiles were green. Oh my God. I did wake your dog up though. Yeah, I know. I go to bed at, like the night before the flight. I go to bed at you know, half 11 or it's, something. By the way, it's before stag, they just to put that into context. Half 11. And I'm thinking, okay, you know, Randolph's gone to bed. Everyone's, it's all calm. We'll I showered. Up, we'll get up at 7 a.m. We'll go to, go to the airport, whatever. And then I just start hearing the dog bark. And he never barks. And you had your phone on, do not disturb. Yeah. So I told you straight away, by the way. The first thing I did was text you. So I went downstairs, checked, and immediately he was calm. Yeah. So I was thinking, okay, well, he hasn't seen something. So what is it? Yeah. Got upstairs, checked my phone. Randall chased a mosquito around the room and started banging on the floor. Was it a mosquito? I think it was a moth. Whatever it, it was, was. It was so thick. I've never seen a moth. I don't know if it, even if it was a moth, but it was like, it had a body. Some call it the, the Vic's penis of the moth world. <laughs> it, it was that big. <laughs> <Why do we>? <laughs> <laughs> That's the last time we talk about his penis. For you, mate, I might bring it Wait, up. Wait, did you actually okay. see his penis on the stage? No, 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 no. no, no. no. Oh. <laughs> I, I, I actually didn't see anyone's penis, it's true. Uh, I saw a bull sack. Oh, yeah. 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 Um, <laughs> no, so this bug. Uh, so what happened was it was really warm uh, that night, as it has been in the UK. And so I opened the window, but I did turn all the lights off and I did shut the blinds as much as it could go. Then I went into the shower. The shower, I did leave the light on in the bathroom for the shower, but it was a different room, you know. Anyway, come back in after drying and all that, and there's this massive fucking moth. I've never seen a moth that big before. Um, John, you know when your phone goes off? I don't mind, by the way, by the way but when it's an Android, it's so much more annoying. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> it, it, yeah, it jars me that you have that phone. I'm so sorry. Not that the phone's going off. Who's calling me? Right, but now your phone's going off. Yeah, what's going on? We're getting... Is yeah. It <laughs> <laughs> a global warning effect? Is, is something going on? Anyway, um, anyway I, I, I slammed it. I, I know, it went to the ceiling. I threw a pillow. Pillow landed on the floor quite loudly. Woke the dog up. No. no. You started slapping the floor with a slipper. Yes, but... I, That's it, what woke the dog, it's dog not, up. It's not. It's it, it both. But the, the, uh, it was the pillow. Because the pillow went really... At, you know, you've got high ceilings, mate. And the... Mo- uh, through pillow and for some reason you must have really high quality pillows too because it's really heavy and it just went vroom, like that and then obviously then I was like well I've made noise now I might as well kill the fucker <laughs> yeah. I'm really scared of moths I'm really scared of- and this was a massive moth and then I was like it's definitely gonna go in my mouth when I'm sleeping and I, I have to kill it 
And then, <laughs> okay. then I had the conundrum after that. I was like, well, it's still really hot. So like, I have to also still open the window. So then I slept with the window open again. Damn, knowing so you that probably ate him off. I, 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 if I'm asleep, I don't mind eating it. You know, there's like a thing of you eat seven spiders in a year. Yeah. I think it's a myth. You probably, probably did do anyway. The Atlas moth. It wasn't that big. What? It wasn't I big. saw it. It, it wasn't, wasn't that big. It was big. It was big. But no, I saw Simon's house. with a great time. Great little night. Had dinner with Talia. Yeah. That was nice. And me. Yeah. Well, sorry. Yes, 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 <laughs> yes. I thought that was implied. Was it not? No. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> had a great night. Me and Talia had a little, little romantic dinner together. Simon, I don't know where he was. But no, yeah, it was nice food. Thanks. I had a little chat together. Yeah. I felt like your fun. son. Oh, all right. I felt, I felt like I was your child. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Uh, uh, anyway, uh, the next day <laughs> was the stag do. Yeah. So we went on the stag do, but we originally were going to be flying um, on a commercial airline. Yeah, n- nothing wrong with that. No. But uh, a friend, a, a secret source. Freezy knows a guy. Freezy knows a guy. That's all we can say yeah. that uh, was able to organize a private jet for us. Yeah. Yeah. What a guy. Yeah, <laughs> good, I've heard good things about him. So yeah, we got the private jet. And while we were on there, We'll just we'll basically just tell you everything that happened that we that we can. <laughs> yeah, obviously can't some things can't tell you. Like Vic's raging cock. There it is again. <laughs> Sorry, I I wish I, I wish I'd say that. So uh one of the things was Freezy had a list. Oh of, so he had a list of uh dice rolls from two to twelve and each thing correlated to a task that Vic had to do that day. Yeah. So, so uh, Freezy was kind of organising the stack. He, 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 he did. He did. He did. He wasn't kind of. He did, he organised. It was his goal. Stack. His job to organise it all. Yeah. Um. And uh, he's he forgot on fellas as well. So listen to that. They did, did a podcast together, right? Vic. So, and, yeah. yeah. But he did. By the way, he did a really good job because it was hard to organise because there's four. There was forty of us plus sort of security. Um. All men. So like most places like villas or trying to go to a club. Yeah. With, yeah. yeah. Well, well, you got fifteen men. Nope. <laughs> you know. Um. He did a great job in the end. So the first thing he did was give Vic a tutu and a crown, a tiara. Yes. Yep. Vic wore for the flight. Yep, yep, yep. Immediately came off. <laughs> it was not there. One was a back slap. One, no, no, the, the outfit was just yeah, before yeah, that. Yeah, the role. yeah, so then we had the list of uh, two to 12. We had like a back slap. We had a uh, dirty pint. We had wear an outfit. We had... Um, Get pissed on. Do a shot. That wasn't on there. Was it not? No. Oh, that's, that's, no, that's that's that anyway. Yeah. yeah so we had a, a bunch of things. And he got a back slap first. And it's yeah. from JJ. Yeah, from, from Mr. KSI. Yeah. It wasn't that bad, you know. Like, it would have hurt. I wouldn't want it. I think the but problem was, we were on a on the jet. I don't, don't, don't sure if I PJ. That. That's what we call it. Private jet. PJ, yeah. yeah and yeah. Um, JJ couldn't really pull back much. Yeah, it wasn't, it wasn't like a go as hard as you can. It was more like make do with the space. I wouldn't want to do it, though. No, I wouldn't want it, but yeah, yeah, JJ definitely could have destroyed him. Yeah, 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 yeah. So yeah, we get off the plane, go to the villa, which Freezy banged the villa. Villa was unreal. Yeah, it was. Oh, and, and well, I'll preface by saying this, by the way. I, in the podcast last time, had a really big go at JJ, and it was gone, it's gone around on TikTok quite a lot, and all the comments have been really mean to KSI. I will say that, although that was a bad incident, and he was annoying on that day, he has put, he pulled it around on your wedding day. He was un- we said that anyway, but he was unreal on your wedding day. And this trip, I thought he was unreal. He was really good. I thought top form. So I want to apologize, and he's now back in the good books. <laughs> I still think the wedding day, he was the best... JJ at an event I've seen. Yeah, he was. Like he, was. Night. he he actually okay. So like, he actually he doesn't he doesn't drink now. People know that, right? Yeah. yeah, he doesn't drink now. And like, we wouldn't peer pressure. We don't peer pressure to anyone. Like, we've never peer pressure Toby. But the only thing we did used to say is like, because he would go home from clubs early a lot, and we were like, well, if you're not going to drink, then like, are you just going to be boring? You know, not not in like a. He would he would say like oh you know the music's starting like oh yeah look I'm hyped dance for three minutes and then sit down on his phone and then and go leave, yeah yo I'm kind of tired I'm yeah. gonna go but now he has a, he's like I rather him not drink now like, he's like, making an effort yeah like yeah. like before people are like, oh you want a shot or whatever now not like people will skip him yeah you know or not it was just sick and he's he's he puts that effort in he's really enjoying himself and um yeah he just he, he just didn't like that villa. <laughs> Yeah. But we just we the thing is we just want to hang out with them more. Like we we'll want to hang out with everyone. Like if anyone left the villa, it'd be, it'd be annoying. Yeah. You know? But anyway. We had this villa that yeah, Freezy banged. It was a sick villa. It's so we had fourteen guys. Yeah. Security stayed somewhere else. We'll tell you who they were. Can we tell, So we had troops. ten troops, which is Sidemen, Cow Cow Randy. Then we had Lachlan, Laserbeam, 
uh, Rob. Woofless. Yeah. Woofless and Major Minder Canadian. <laughs> Bajan Canadian Mitch. Sorry, I got it wrong. Bajan. All goats, by the way. We had Bajan. By the way, I was being an absolute jokester in the group chat because Vic made a group chat with the normal. <laughs> oh my God. And then he put a picture of like them boys and I was pretending that they weren't, I didn't know they were in the group chat. So I just kept being like, who the fuck are these guys? And then like, he put a picture of them again. I was like, no, for on real, who are these guys? And then he got, they got and I don't think I put it in there. I was like, I hope these guys aren't coming to the like, <laughs> Well, when we got to the airport as well, you were like, are you guys coming? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> They broke the ass a little bit, but yeah. yeah um, they're all really good. They're all really good guys. The villa. Yeah, the villa. It had like, so it had a 11, no, 10 bedrooms. Yeah. And then we had four like RVs. I never saw them. You should have gone and seen them. I know. They weren't that bad. Oh yeah, I, I'd only heard They rumors. were bad in the sense that like, they were quite warm. Sometimes the AC wouldn't work. The water didn't work. And probably a few other things. But like, as like quality, they were pretty good. And then even when some people left the, the trip, um, the space in the main villa and Lux they didn't take there. it because he, yeah. he enjoyed his, uh, his RV. Yeah. Who well, was in the RVs? So we, th we basically, we played a game to see who would get what room. Yeah. And you we said, Vic. well, Vic immediately was like, all right, we, we give him the best room. But he didn't he want goes, it. He didn't, but we were just like, then he went, he walked off and did something else. Yeah. So we were like, all right, Vic's in that room. He's, that's the, there's a room with a hot tub. He's in there. Uh, and then we spin the wheel. And by the way, I was literally slate. Josh was doing the wheel. And I literally start talking to all the Aussies and the Canadians going like, no, nah, fuck this guy. Yeah, he, yeah, he, yeah. He yeah. controls this wheel. Like at uh, the Italy wedding. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he literally got first pick or yeah. like second pick. And he was there for one day. And it was his wheel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was yeah. like, no, nah, don't trust this guy. Yeah. S spins the wheel. I'm first. But so he, he did get it. second, by the way. Huh? He did get second. Or he was close by. Oh, he got like eighth. Josh did. Yeah. Lachlan got second, I think, and then Harry. Oh. Or Harry, then Lachlan. Okay, okay. But yeah, I got first. Lachlan, Harry. I don't know where you got. I was like pretty... I was like two away from... The RVs. Yeah. yeah. JJ was the bottom. But I'm going to be honest. I was pissed. What, uh, you, what? Because. You did have time. No, this is the thing. So I said... I was like, oh, should we go have a look around? And everyone went, no, no, no. Let's just do this now. And then we'll pick. Like you can go look and pick. Yeah. So I got it. And then I walked off. I like I got first pick. I was like, I'm right, gonna we'll go look. Yeah. Went and looked at these. There was like the main villa, a little outhouse with three rooms, and then down here with two rooms. Yeah. And I was like, okay, I'll go look. Looked at those three, and everyone started going, Yo, hurry up, pick. I was yeah. like, What? I thought I was gonna look, and you could spin the next one. They went, No, we can't spin until you pick. Nah, we were spinning. Well, the, everyone started shouting at me and went, You have to pick now. I thought. So I went, All right, I'll just take that one because it's nice. Oh, I thought you'd. I thought you'd pick that one. I thought. I thought you were like. Um, I haven't even seen the main. I still haven't seen the main villa to this oh, day. Okay, okay. So yeah, me, Lachlan, and Harry all choose this one, and then none of us had seen the ones that because Josh had did a walkthrough. They, no, ever, everyone slept on. So what happened was we, we we were quite low down, so we knew that you went that way. We knew that then like Bez and that went to the main one. So we and then we were like, okay, well let's just look at the other side then. While and then then I think most of us didn't look, look at these ones for ages. Yeah. So we went. Um, yeah, me. Josh had already done a tour. The first thing we did when we got there was oh, okay. him and two others did a tour. But only the main one. They, they, he didn't know. Yeah, they looked at that. They didn't. The one I was in, really? the one Josh was in, they didn't know. No, because I, I went with me, him, JJ together, and they that was their first reaction. Yeah, because basically he had, like, it was nuts. Yeah. Like, it was literally, like, five rooms into one. And he had, like, his own little private garden. He had a lit True. living room, like a cold. kitchen, everything. And we're all like, wait, wait, wait. Hang on, no, no, this is like... We said... Oh, we can change, you know. First place, second place, third place can all go. Actually, fuck it, I want that room. We'll and then we walked later. over, and they, him and Rob were just like, "No, you're not. We're not moving." Man, man. And just started refusing until we said, "Well, that's the best room, so Vic gets it." Well, Vic wanted it to swap anyway, right? Vic wanted. Well, he's yeah. He took Rob's room. Rob moved into that that one. Yeah, yeah. Um, and Josh ended up keeping the room. I was like, "Bro, did you see my room?" <laughs> no, I didn't see any rooms except the one that I had to pick. <laughs> I thought no one saw my room. No, I had like a nice little. I had yeah. like a little villa on my own. Do you have the little up the hill on that little? Yeah, it's just like a little house. Yeah. <laughs> it was actually sick, but it smelled. Oh. My AC wouldn't really work. It was on, but it wouldn't work. Like, it, it kept the room cool, but like, if I'm in bed, it's not, it's not cold. That makes no sense. I mean, how often are you guys really in the rooms anyway, realistically? Um, it was more, we didn't have hot water in our little outhouse part. Every, wow. every morning I woke up still drunk. <laughs> <laughs> not, not even hungover. I was like, literally, until the first like 
tea on golf, I was still drunk that day. At go kart, I was drunk. <laughs> he wasn't. Shit. Uh, <laughs> nah, I think that's legal. Okay. By the way, the, the go kart guys were jokes, you know. We we were joked in the way that they're gonna be like, uh, you know, when you go to UK, there's loads of rules. They sit you in a room, they yeah. play a video, red flag, blue uh, blue flag, or black flag, all this stuff um, for ages, and then we were joking that they'll be like, um, vamos, you know, <laughs> vamos. And they, literally, they, we all got in the go karts. They went, um, go, uh, this accelerate, this brake, go. <laughs> it went. <laughs> I couldn't put my seatbelt on once, and the guy was like, um, the first joke I did, but the second one, it wouldn't come out um, at all. So he was like, I just, just don't use it. <laughs> I love less. Well, yeah, after we, after we picked that, we played a game of football. Yeah, I actually did. So, yeah, did, this yeah. is the other thing. This was the main thing about the villa for me was, firstly, being able to have um, 14 guys there is a dream. I've, I've dr always dreamt of that. Yep. Oh, yeah, also, that, the, that is my fantasy. the RVs was... Toby, Calux, Calux, Bayesian Canadian, Mitch, and Rob. and Rob. No, not Rob. No, no. Uh, who was in the other? Lachlan. No. Who Lachlan was it? Was next Lachlan to was next to me, yeah. Uh, who got the last Toby. one? Toby. I said Toby. Toby, Lux, Mitch. Fuck. Cal Freezy. Freezy. Yeah. Yeah, I felt bad for Freezy. Organized the whole thing. Yeah. But he literally said I wouldn't have got an RV that I wasn't happy to stay in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which is fair. Yeah. Yeah, we we then played a game of football, yep. which was very sick. Very good. It had it had its own little seven aside pitch. Yeah, had a little beach volleyball net. We didn't court. play that. Like, we played that. We didn't play that. Had like a little jungle gym. Yeah, some bets were made there, and some bets were won. Yeah, those guys bet way too much. The the, the Canadian, the Aussies, and the Canadians. Yeah, they do. They do. Bet nonstop. We were playing a poker game at one point for like five hundred pound. Everyone buys in, so the number one prize was four grand second was like a grand and a half third was just 500 pounds so your money back and it got to the point where it was me Lux and JJ fine as the last ones like 2 3 a.m 3 a.m whatever and we're not talking very quiet very like serious yeah playing for and, and like, again a lot of money playing for four grand but then you have Lachlan Lannan and Mitch and Rob or whoever and um, already lost already out and They're they were gambling more. for more money than we were <laughs> playing for playing some stupid game that like let's say stupid I mean like a silly game you know um laughing having a great time and they were like there's a probably like Bro, I was like 1020 grand you know I said bet. to Lachlan I was like the reason I don't like playing poker with you guys not you specifically is because it just goes no one talks it's like it's good vibes start, this one's good vibes at the start it was yeah by the end it wasn't no it was just the world having a good time right well I'll, I was sat as a viewer and it it did not look fun oh <laughs> no you was very drunk that day I was and that's why I was like this is fucking boring oh yeah no, <laughs> that's I, why I went to their table and started dealing oh yeah no I, I, we had a good time Okay. Well, you just said you were sat in silence. No, but we, we, it's a more serious game. But it wasn't. It wasn't like silence because it wasn't fun. Well, look, we like, like, each other up. Lachlan and also, like, I had oh, looks of pants. That looks looks one, one poker, by the way. But I didn't let him win because I tried to still win. But like, I was like, I'm going to bed now, so let's just go crazy, you know. Well, Lachlan was like, Nah, man, you have to play. It can't be that bad. It can't be that bad. Afterwards, he was like, Yeah, fuck, you were right. <laughs> that was fucking. Well, I only because I, I fucked him over. No, he was just like it was. When they play, they all like chat shit the whole time. Oh, okay. No one, no one talks. Yeah. It's really, yeah. yeah. Anyway, <laughs> it was really like quiet. I'm talking. They're playing poker and they're just silence. It was yeah. yeah. No one wants. No one wants to show cards or anything. No one wants to like. We did that. We showed cards every, every time. You are you sure you weren't drunk? I was. I showed cards every time. Okay, you might have. Yeah. Not everyone yeah. did. Yeah. But, um, is, is it a lot of ego poker? With, is it is it ego and money, or what? Why is it? Why is it so serious? It's ego. Yeah, it's ego. Yeah, because the other guys, when the Aussies and Canadians are playing, they literally they'll put money on the line, but they're literally like if they bluff once and they they just want to laugh at the other person. Yeah, they yeah. don't even care. Yeah, it's true. <laughs> they don't, they don't care about the money, which is bad. But yeah, uh, yeah. yeah, we played football. Then we went out and we saw Skepta doing a house set. Yeah. Yeah, and then the Martinez brothers, but a lot of us left. I don't know who they are. Neither did I. Martinez brothers, but they're apparently fucking massive. Yeah, yeah. That was a good. That was a very good night. I enjoyed that. I just sat 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 there, sat there with Shisha the whole night. Yeah, literally sat literally in one spot. I was having a great time. That was a good night. Second day, what did we do? Second, Second day, day was Ocean Beach. No. Yeah, Ocean Beach. We went Ocean Beach. Yeah, that was that was the day I got very drunk. <laughs> yeah, pretty, but, I've never I've never in my entire life seen you that drunk. Really? I haven't pers me personally I've never seen you that, that drunk. Okay. Let's say I've been sidemen 
Oh yes. So I've been more drunk than that at least like three times yeah, in Simon videos. Yeah, that's the drunkest I've ever seen you. Yeah. Which one? The one when you passed out. In Original Cowan. pub golf. Yeah. I mean, that's the drunkest I've probably ever been. But also, like, I can't I, be. I can't be more drunk. <laughs> but that's like, I guess, like maybe in a setting that's not necessarily club if that makes sense like yeah. say vegas we'll go and drink but then everyone goes back to their room see i really enjoyed ocean beach because it's like the whole time we could talk yeah I see. it wasn't just standing there in a club like all right wait for a good song yeah 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 but yeah we get there and uh the whole thing starts of like all right we're gonna get 100 bottles yeah and then we're just gonna spray them on vic that was the idea is you know pass them around to everyone and we go oh, okay spray the bottles and then we all just turn and spray vic because he's yeah. a stag by the way by the way it's expensive but the bottles of champagne are like produced to be sprayed. Those bottles are not supposed to be drank. So like they are like um, we're paying for piss water. Yeah, yeah. It's not we're not we're not wasting like co- uh, champagne. It's we're just p- wasting money. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. That, that's, that's yeah. <laughs> Horrifically. Yeah, they they literally are made to be sprayed. It's so horrible. How much? How much money? How much are we talking? Well, let me explain <laughs> what we did first, okay. and then I'll tell you the total. Okay. So we got the hundred bottles, uh, and we start spraying Vic. And then I just see fucking 35. I really want to say the C word because we've been hanging out with the Australians oh. all week and that's all they say. People. But yeah. The everyone everyone behind us, everyone in front of us and all the workers around us all got given bottles to just spray us. Yeah, it's, yeah, because, right, they, the way they transport it, some just get delivered, but then, like, sorry, like uh, carried. But then obviously we had like the uh, signs of his eyebrows for Vic. And then um, on a boat, like this girl's like, like driving a boat across the pool and they're all, all the, the champagnes are in that yeah. boat. So then obviously people like who are close or watching the madness, they can just grab those. Yeah. Like it is kind of like a just, if you want to join in, you can. Yeah. But then, by the way, um, time goes by. Everyone, oh, by the way, it's, it, was like a, it was like a war zone. Like, honestly, it was, it was, it was fun. But it was like, cr- like oh, the first no one, one could see. Everyone was like, I was literally like, ah, <laughs> like running around like, ah. It's because we had a lot of people around us that did recognize us. So they were kind of like, oh, this is, I can get to spray them. Yeah, yeah, So yeah. we're literally getting ruined. Yeah, yeah. And I'm pretty certain I got drunk from just that. I was already drunk, but oh, what, just from like soaking in. All oh, right, yeah. was, we were all doing like suicide shots through our eyes. All oh, right, bro. The amount of champagne we do, got in you, our eyes. If you go, if you get champagne in your eyes, you get drunk from that. No, but like you know, you can do shots through your yeah, eyes, yeah. right? Kevin so and the, Perry go large. Can you? you? Kevin and Perry when he does the eyeball shot. I was very young when I watched that. Oh. Well, it doesn't get you drunk. Mad. Oh. Yeah, I was so honestly, I was so blind and yeah. like. I was literally like, I was trying to open a bottle. I, couldn't, I, I think I sprayed one champagne bottle because I couldn't open it. I couldn't see. But then Lock, that, that all dried off. Lachlan got hit. Yeah, but he had glasses. He had his glasses. Thanks for cork. Because that was bad. Remember, fully that went Island, into his eye. Love Island person. Hmm? Like, uh, someone from Love Island got blinded over that. Yeah. Remember. So he was lucky. Um, yes, and then we just chilled for a while. But then, I don't know if you remember this part. So then we're all chilling. Uh, by the way, when they first did the bottles, they, the, the waitresses and, and stuff came and um, put like towels over the drinks and took my shisha away. I was fuming. Um, <laughs> because they were. Uh, Obviously expecting it, you know. And then, like, we're chilling. A few hours later now, JJ just, like, like smiling, vibing. And then, like, we just sat there. And again, they come over and start putting a towel over. And we're like, hold on. What's that for? And then she was like, oh, I'm not sure, actually. Not no, sure. before that, though, JJ was like, oh, yeah, I'm thinking of doing it again. And it was me and... it was me, I can't remember. It was me and someone else. And we went, don't do it. And yeah. it was Lachlan. Yeah. And Lachlan was like, bro, it's diminishing returns. Yeah. And JJ didn't understand what that meant. But then he was like, you've done it once. It was gas. Like, it was a lot of money, but it was gas. This time, you're going to get the reaction of like, ah, oh, this is kind of annoying now. And yeah. it's not going to be as fun, and it's going to cost more money. Yeah, it's true. Yeah, um, it is a waste. I mean, it's a waste of money. And then the waitress said, oh, we can get it cheaper. And I was like, "How? Like, firstly, how much? And then we said, oh, can we get everyone involved? Can we send one bottle to every single no, table? No, before that. Oh, well, they before didn't... that, he was going to buy another one just on the way. Oh. So she came and put the towel over, and we said, we, we, me, Bez, and like, uh, Fridge, like, like, nah, it seems like her, like, what's this? And she's like, oh, no, I, I, I'm not sure what's going on. And then, like, literally, we were like, JJ, what's going on? Is this, is this you or not? Is this you? He's, and he was like, he did his, like, <laughs> yeah. you know. Um, and then we were like, fuck off, man. Nah, nah, please, no, please, no. Because everyone had just recovered. Um, so then she, she took it off. It was like, oh, so, a mistake, mistake, mistake. And then, like, but then, uh, just before she said that, I think Freezy or someone saw, or maybe Bez, saw him go to the guy and like, cancel it, cancel it. Yeah. So he got one, canceled it, and then the final one. Yeah, then he did all that stuff, and then he eventually was like, all right, let's get like two bottles for every single table in the club, which I didn't see, by the way. They had them. Did they? Yeah, and they okay. were told to wait till eight o'clock. Okay. 
and then yeah we got another 100 bottles and it was but this time we had more we actually had more on the table because like they brought 100 rather than like giving them to everyone yeah, around yeah yeah and they brought a big bottle yeah but then you were like um you were like uh this is way too many by the way and i was like no nah, i think it's good it's, it's fine and then we we spread i sprayed one turned around and they're all gone yeah i i, I had <laughs> no idea how how did everyone get through no there? i said it was i said it wasn't enough i said this definitely isn't 100 oh i think they took away like 30 and gave us because we had a bottle that was literally like that was a that was the first one was it the bottle was the first one fuck I was the bottle oh my god and then harry oh i don't remember god. any of it bro yeah yeah yeah, yeah. The, fir the first big champagne one was the first one and like well where we got the picture of me drinking yeah 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 my head looks like this but <laughs> yeah there's some freezies 0 0.5 lens go yeah go on freezies uh instagram this picture go to the right just like next one i think it is that bro, one, yeah. Look how small my head is. Because <laughs> it's a wide angle 0 0.5 lens and at the right angle, it's massive. I mean, it no, but big, the bottle was that was a big, big bottle, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but so like, people, when people drink that, they kind of like, it goes everywhere and stuff. So I did it and I was just drinking it like normally. And they, they, they kept saying to me, drink it, man, drink it. I'm like, bro, I have been the entire time. I reckon I drank an entire bottle of champagne when they were holding it up there. I was doing that and everyone was like, like I'll tip it a bit more. Like it's not coming out, and I'm like, I fucking, I've been drinking yeah, this for eight seconds solid. You can't, you can't say that while you're you're it, drinking in your mouth. Yeah. yeah. And then um, by the way, then they also had like these Don Julio um, bottles of like tequila, really tall ones as well. And then literally Harry, me, it's me, Freezy, and Harry. And Harry Absolutely. goes, um, he goes, oh come on, let's go. And, and like like do that with the uh, tequila. And I was like, Harry, no, like, I hate this drink. I throw up. Like, no way. He's like, nah, come on, come on. Freezy's like, nah, let's do, it, let's do it. So we all do it. Harry literally. So you're supposed to, when you do that, you're supposed to shot it, right? With, with the vodka ones and the, in the yeah, yeah. yeah, you're supposed to shot it. Uh, and I just see him like dr he's drinking it. So I'm like, no, nah, nah, enough, enough, enough. And I, I do it like hate it, obviously. So, I, mean, I, I don't mind tequila, but like you I can't shot. You don't want to drink it. I, mm -hmm. I am the, with tequila. I am the closest to, to throwing up initially after a shot with tequila. Like it's the strongest thing ever. I'm almost, almost like fuck. Well, you need the chaser, right? That's why. Yeah. yeah. Uh, what is it? The sort of yeah, line. yeah, 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 yeah. But anyway, and then after that, freezes it, sips it. Harry goes again after us, and then again. In in like after each other, and then half an hour goes by, or whatever, or ten minutes, or whatever. And he does it again, and then he was finished. Yeah, he was well, finished that night. He spent <laughs> forty minutes putting his shoes on. <laughs> yeah, he did. Like, he was done. <laughs> yeah, but we go from there back to the house, and that's where we do the poker night. Yeah, yeah. and Harry and Toby are just like they just disappear. Well, Harry literally couldn't play. He's he's he actually yeah. like passed out. He was gone. But that's where um, did we play football that day? Uh, you guys did, yeah. We played a mini match. I went to a nap. That's the only but time we played before Ocean Beach. No, we you must. played before poker. Uh, there's no way. No, before Ocean Beach. Before Ocean Beach. I was gonna say because yeah, yeah. there was no way like I was playing in that stage. What did I do then? I was gonna oh. say we had a little like four v four match. Oh, I know. I went. I went. I went to do something. Yeah. yeah, we had like a four v four or five v five match, and um, yeah. yeah then Ocean we played Beach. poker. Yeah, yeah. And like Harry and Toby weren't playing. I was kind of like, I don't really want to play. I'm not really fast. Yeah, yeah. Locke was like, you're playing. You're well, playing. I didn't think you were playing, but then he was I wasn't, grabbed you. I wasn't playing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I got dragged into it. So I'm like, bro, I don't want to play. Yeah. And I'm fucking drunk at this yeah. point. So I'm like, I'm not playing. Yeah. I'm very just, please let me just, just, you know, sit in the corner mm. and just rock. And um, I just go, you know what? All right, all in. Yeah. Mitch is like, yeah, all in. And then Josh is all in. First hand. And this is 500 quid each. And a straight, like, there's a straight, basically. Yeah. Like, I think it was one, two, three, four, five, or whatever. Yeah. And Mitch has a four. I haven't seen my cards. Yeah. So I'm like, okay, well, he's got a straight. Josh turns his over. He's got a pair, of, he's got pocket aces. Yeah, and an ace, and on, an the ace yeah, on the yeah, table. Yeah, yeah. And then I just turn over mine. I'm like, yeah, I'm out. Cool. And I have a straight. So yeah, you're a king and a four. So we so knock out every, Josh everyone's like, <laughs> Yeah, everyone, everyone's like, like, fuck off if you have a four and you had a four. Yeah. So me and Mitch split it. Josh is knocked out with three aces <laughs> yeah, in the yeah, first yeah, yeah. And then I just I just give him my money. You, jo you give Josh the chips. Yeah, I just he, went, plays I, you, yeah. he was like, oh, I wanted to play. And I was like, okay, here you go. Take yeah, mine. Yeah. And he yeah. ended up doing well. Yeah, he did it actually. I was just like, I just want him to get, I want him to win. I can give him my money back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that was good. Although one of the dealers that we had, <laughs> some foil just <laughs> fell from the ceiling. The uh, poker dealers. Other, yeah, other yeah. dealers. Yeah, they were, he, they, they were sound. <laughs> <laughs> they uh, it got to like one a.m. or something, and he was like, "Oh, is it alright if I take some photos for my um, oh, like God, yeah, for sure. my website?" 
we're thinking, all right, you know, just take one photo or whatever. Yeah. He films for 25 minutes. Yeah, he was, and he was like, and he's getting like close ups of JJ's so face. It like, was like, you know, when like on people on TikTok do those clips where it's like, uh, Oh, I, I I found a stranger walking down the street and I asked him to take a video and this is how it turns <laughs> yeah. out and you think it's gonna be really good but they meme it and they're like <laughs> they're like run run a tree didn't it? Like, he probably made some good videos but just the, the angle he was doing was really funny. At one point he went up to the chips and just was like this. I was like, what? surely you've got videos of chips already? <laughs> yeah, that's a, there's no location you, you, in the back. It's your there. table <laughs> and your chips. But he was sick though. He's sick. Most sick guys. Yeah, most sick, most sick guys. Yeah. But yeah, that night ended. Um, Sorry, did we say how much got spent on these bottles then? Right. So. I can't remember the split, but I'm pretty certain it was twenty five thousand pounds, uh, euros. Each time or total? No, total. total time? I think it was ten and fifteen, or fifteen and ten. I thought that. Yeah, I I thought the first one was fifteen. I think the first one was fifteen, and then we we said, look, well, well, we we bargained down to ten. Okay, for okay. The other one, we were like, throw in two for every single table, and we'll do it for ten. And then just, well, the food and drinks was five grand. Yeah, that's funny because Harry thought it was five hundred pounds. Yeah, he tried to pay. He, he was like, yeah, I saw 497, so I tried to pay. My bank card got declined. <laughs> and it turns account? out it was 4970. <laughs> yeah, it's just that account, you know. But um, that was funny. Because like, I saw him do it. He's like, yeah, yeah, I saw that out. I was like, mm. not, not, not like he wouldn't do that anyway. He was, I'm sure he would pay that. But it was just like very quick to decide that, you know. <laughs> usually, usually it'll be like, who's got the side bank, the side bank card, you know. Yeah. Da, da, da. Um, oh, that day, Vic had to do, uh, he rolled the dice and got a shoey. Oh yeah. So yeah. Uh, he was originally like straight away like, all right, I'll do. A oh shoey. my god! And I'm not gonna lie, it was it was I was trying to mess with them, so I was like, no, 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 no. let's get a fan. Yeah, <laughs> let's yeah, get yeah, a fan yeah, at Ocean yeah. Beach, and he has to drink. Well, they were looking for look, uh, Freezy and Harry were looking for a long time to try and find like, well, how do I say this politely? The sweatiest foot, <laughs> <laughs> like the gro the most gross foot you can find. You know, so they're thinking maybe maybe we'll try and find someone who's been working there all day and walking around. They ended up finding a fan who was sick. They they bought they bought us some uh, shots. They bought us. They bought us 20 shots and yeah. so we sent back like 50. Yeah, yeah. And then... Um, Harry went and talked to All guys, by the way, just to clear yeah, up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, yeah, they came, two of them came over and he just pulled off, like he pulled his shoe off these like brand new LVs. Yeah. Weren't stinky. No. And uh, yeah. By, by the way, so, so they filled up, <clears throat> they asked for like vodka, lemonade or something. And um, I, I think the waitress misheard him. So she filled a whole cup of vodka, just straight vodka. And he found out but, but it wasn't a prank at all. No, no, no. Um, Cause we made a joke about it. We were like, imagine if we just filled it up with vodka. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then, and then obviously he found out. But I, I mean, I'm, I'm, I, I kind of wish he didn't know because not he wouldn't have drank it because he can't. You can't do that. He'd know. But it'd have been funny to be, for him to be like, what the fuck? Well, did you see Freezy? Freezy basically had both glasses and was like, smelled them and went, bro, that's just vodka. <laughs> and I was like, no, I saw her pour it because yeah. it was out the clear jug. Ah, okay. And I thought it was lemonade. No, no, vodka, so he yeah. went, have a sip. So I literally just took a big swig. Oh, man. And then just like dribbled it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and I was like, yeah, yeah it's vodka. Yeah. Uh, so then we had the, that was Wednesday. Yeah. Thursday was the boat day. Yeah. Sick. I love boat days. And I missed the dice roll, but it was donate a thousand pounds to M7. Oh, yeah. Sick. Yeah. Sick. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Good. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie. I would have, I, I would have donated the money myself to, to see him roll again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. True. True. But then we went on a boat, yeah. which was very sick. The boat, boat days are always sick, man. I think oh, boat days are always the be our best days, man. So fun. But it's because we all just sit there and talk. Yeah, yeah, because you can't do anything else. Yeah, but we could do that at the villa, but everyone wants to just go do something else. Yeah, but um, nah, it's more like, I don't know, like the, the wind, the sea, the sun. It's just like a nice vibe. Music, it's just like good vibes, you know? Yeah. I mean, it is always good vibes. If we had a boat at the villa, I'm sure we'd all be on the boat at the villa. You know what I mean? I don't know why there would be a boat at the villa. Yeah, I mean, just in the pool. <laughs> in the pool. <laughs> it's a giant yacht. Yeah. And then there was like an impromptu night out. Yeah, yeah. Um, which like, I think like five or five of us didn't go on. I think it was you. Me, JJ, Harry. Bez. Uh, Bez. Mitch. Did Freezy go? Yeah, Freezy went. Yeah, he was very on the fence. He was like, I'm not going to go. <clears throat> then he did go. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah there was no. five of us didn't go. Yeah. Um, but you said it was really good. Was Honestly, like maybe the like the best club night. See, which is weird because I know Vic was like the best. The first night was yeah, like the yeah, best yeah, night yeah, ever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, he said, but he said that after the first night. After the first night, so he hadn't got to do the ones yet. Anyway, now that that, that one was like just chill. it was like more chill. It, was, it wasn't like crazy night, but it was just fun. Yeah, good, really good music, really good like sound system, and just like f fun vibes. What genre was it? Well, it was all house, like, well EDM house. But I, bro, it I loved more it. More EDM than house. Like it wasn't like the Skepta night. Well, that was that was yeah okay. That was like deep. House. That was like deep house. Yeah, but like I, honestly, because I, I'm like I actually I, I was like you know I can either like. I, I like all music anyway, 
But obviously, I, I, club nights, I would prefer like R&B hip hop because I know the songs, sing around, do the lyrics and stuff. But I was like, you know what? I might as well just enjoy it. I was like, this, this is music playing. I might as well just enjoy it. And I was like, you know what? I should look. Uh, when, yeah. you, when you have that mindset, I, 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 I had a sick time. I love the music. The, guy, the, guy, the first guy, Jonas Blue, was sick. And then the second guy was like. Why well, Jonas Blue? I've heard that name. Well, because he was. Oh, you went there. Yeah, yeah. but he was, he was. You must have seen a sign in Ibiza. And then it was like. Nick Schultz, is that, is that, is, he, is that someone? Uh, Robin. Schultz. Robin Schultz. That's what Robin I'm Schultz. Waves. Robin Schultz. Robin Schultz. Oh, yeah. yeah, he did the song waves. with Oliver Tree. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's yeah. Waves as well. And so he, he was. Is that that song? I, don't know. I think so. I don't know. He, was the, he was the main that night. But I actually thought Jonas Blue was, was even sicker. Had some sick drops. But um, yeah, the next day. Well, any stories from that? Yeah, but not too many to say. <laughs> then we had the final day, which yeah. was yesterday, which yeah. was like. Um, all of <laughs> weirdly, right? Everyone who no, actually, there was a bunch of us that didn't go go karting. Yeah, because we all just slept. Everyone yeah. was because we kept doing things really early. Yeah. So a bunch of us didn't go go karting. You guys went go karting. Came back. Then a, none of you guys did. The, he organized yoga and massages. Yeah. And you guys didn't do that. Nah. We did that. Wait, massages for every single person. Well, yeah, but a bunch of people didn't have them. Um, then like you, Freezy, Josh, and Harry went and played golf. Yeah, didn't get the invite. Cheers. I didn't organize this. <laughs> I, I I just like I do that. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> they just said we we're gonna play golf. I was like, okay, calm. I was go. gutted though. I, I was gutted. One, I would have played golf, but two, we you really wanted. To, you literally could have come. We couldn't. It was four people. But like, so so when Lux was gonna go, but he was like finished, so Josh took his place. But when Lux was gonna go, Josh was just gonna go and just come, just sit, like just caddy, drink, have a beer. Well, yeah. Um, but. We really wanted to play another f like five aside game. Ah, okay, yeah. But then, yeah, everyone was gone. But then we ended up going David Getter. After. Yeah, David Getter. I was sick. Yeah, I was sick. Again, like the person before, I was like, I can listen to this music for a bit, but whoa, we were whoa, there. Whoa, 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 whoa! What do you mean the person before? Miss Monique. Why are you saying that was bad? Because it was just this, like, even Harry. Harry likes that kind of music, and he came over to me and was like, "Yo, I bet this drop's gonna be." <laughs> yeah, but then by <laughs> and the way, dropped into. <laughs> yeah, but then by the way, when um, David Get was on, Harry was sort of directly behind me, and when it dropped, he would sing dun, 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 whatever the tune was. He'd sing it <laughs> like that. But he, by the way, by the way, you know when I dropped that glass. Yeah, right. Because I was there. Tried to blame it on me. Well, it was a joke. <laughs> I know. I was blaming anyone who was anyone who was there. I was like, the fuck, man. Because um, like, there was a table but in front of us that was like lower down on the balcony thingy, and I was like, you know, I, I reckon I can sneak a glass onto their banister. And leave it there and make people jokes. And I was like, and this is by the way, this is why I'm glad it happened, by the way. I'm very lucky. Because I was like, let me first test ours to see if it actually does balance on that on it. So you would have smashed it on their side. Yeah, and but no, but also it'd have gone down to the floor onto the main bit. And, and, and that would have been I would have just run off. Would have gone into the piss. Yeah, some bloke just pissed in the corner. <laughs> just on the dark well, floor, to, just walked it against the wall, piss. <laughs> walked off. Yeah, they don't, no one caught him. Did he, a few people around him. Did he were, piss? Yeah. Well, it, it was literally it was going to. No, he pissed. And the you could see the liquid. It was a big puddle. <laughs> yeah. I don't know how, but it started moving onto the dance floor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it, oh, it was grim. But yeah, that was a good night as well. That was. And then, uh, but during, so, so then, yeah, so then I put the glass on our one and it fell off and smashed. <laughs> so I was glad I didn't put it up. Bro, it smashed so fast, does that make sense? <laughs> like, I just put it there and I was like going to grab it. And before I, it just, I was like, I've done it. The dice roll for that day was the outfit. Outfit, yeah. Yeah. Uh, so he had to he had to wear an outfit that Freezy had chosen, which Freezy planned a great holiday. He had a stinker with this one. Well, no, because Vic looked good in it. Exactly. He was wearing jorts. He literally he was like, no, he didn't wear those. No, he no, but he should have. Like that, that was the outfit. Uh, he looked great no, he in them. He didn't wear that. No, no, because it was, it was a club. You know, oh, I didn't allowed. even see him wear them. Oh, yeah, he, he, he went. Freezy went and put him the whole, whole outfit on. And oh, came he came down to food. Down to, to oh, dinner. he came to yoga straight after. No, he didn't. He came to food. Oh, first. he came to yoga and Gymshark shorts. Yeah, he came down, sat with us to eat, then he did yoga. Okay. He wasn't sure if he could eat before. I don't know. Yeah, uh, he, had yeah he, bought him a, he bought him a top as like, a, oh, you know, you're the stag. We're going to make you look stupid. Yeah. And then he put it on and everyone went, oh, it looks all right. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, he looked, he looked great. But he'd have some um, completely clean, no two ways uh, that then we all customized. So we all drew and wrote like like names and stuff on it. Yeah. Which was really funny because I imagine what kind of stuff we could put on there. Yeah, it was a lot of pegging and pedophile jokes. Yeah. On his shoes. Not necessarily linked, by the way. No, they weren't linked. Uh, and then we made him roll one more time. What was, what was the other roll at dinner? Um, he rolled 
Chewy. He rolled dress in funny clothes. Oh, wax leg. Oh wax. yeah, that was fine though because he looked great. And again, he literally just. It was like a sensitive skin one, so he just kind of put it on, and went. All right, and then he. Had a I think missing. he should actually shave his legs. He should. Yeah, he his great. leg looked nice. Yeah, I'd, I'd touch that leg. Yeah. Uh, and then we, we flew time. home. Yeah, we got another private jet. Yeah. <laughs> Again, last minute decision. Yeah. Was, uh, although apparently the jet that we did like reserve had a cat on it and it had like a problem with the cats. So they had to go and like land the cat somewhere. So they had to get a different one. Yeah. <laughs> Interesting. I thought at first it was a cow. I was like, how can a cow get on a private jet? <laughs> but it, the end story is it didn't. <laughs> For fuck's sake. <laughs> well, uh, we're going to go through like little details yeah, yeah, yeah like the funniest part very quick question did okay. Vic dj at all no yeah oh. he did he dj a bit <laughs> he'd be, he'd be he a did air DJ. like you know his new dance is uh when a dj's on he starts kind of you know eq in doing what they're doing but he, yeah now he, Vic had a, Vic, by the way Vic had a great time which i remember we all, we all did but he had especially a great time he kept saying like it's fucking sick trip man it's the best it's the best it's the best, it's the best. So that's really great i know what my funniest part was what we went to this restaurant, right? So, on the boat. We get the boat. We go chill somewhere. We pull up on this beach. Oh, we have to mention this. We go to this restaurant. And it's like this amazing restaurant where... I think... So, basically, Freezy was telling us. You basically book a time slot. And that table is like yours until the restaurant closes. So, if you leave, that table doesn't get filled. We go in. One table behind us is like Gary Cahill's there. Yeah. Another table, there's like a lot of the... Uh, oh, so you guys knew who was there from the... Restaurant, yeah, from the start. I only knew who was there when we were at the um, at the, at the beach. Oh, and the, the taxi. Oh, you know, he was sat. That's why right. it's freezing. Like, like, he sat right behind this, Steve. This, his mate was talking to me, and then he was talking to me, but no, I didn't know he was at first. Mad. And I was like, this guy looks like him, and I was like, is it? But I didn't know he was in the restaurant. Oh yeah, because mm-hmm. then we also had um, another table that was a lot of the English women's team. Was it actually? Yeah. Oh, see. Uh, Alex Scott was there. Oh, I didn't see her. Yeah, I um, saw one but, because when we were saying like, is that them? And I was like, it looks like one, but I didn't yeah. know. But then. So, the, so they, they basically have a DJ the whole time and then every like 10 minutes maybe the DJ starts turning up the volume and puts on a banger and everyone gets up and starts dancing around and stuff like that. Really good vibes. But we're all fucking hungover as hell. But we see this guy on the left of us who keeps standing on, this, on his chair. Well, well, well. He, my, my right. Okay, you're right. He's okay. standing on the chair and he's just clapping out of time and he's like looking around kind of like, you know, I'm fucking sick. Yeah, yeah. So then we finish our meal. We go out to the beach and you have to get like a, what's it called? Like a transfer to your- Dinghy. A dinghy. Kind of. That is literally a dinghy. It was not a dinghy. It was. Google a dinghy. Can, would you say a dinghy could fit 15, 16 people? Mm. If, it's a, if, it's, if it's a big dinghy? Mm-mm, no, that's, yeah, well, yeah, I mean, big dinghy. I don't I'd also see what see, it looked like. It looked like a- did it look like an inflatable, did it have inflatable sides? Oh, that is literally a dinghy. Yeah. <laughs> no, that's what I imagine a dinghy as. Well, you can get different sizes. So you literally kind of get a different... Yeah. 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 Can you it, type large dinghy and see it, it looked like, up? If you go back, go back a page, go off, go off Google Images. That top right one. It yeah. looked like that, but bigger. Yeah. Yeah, it's just a big dinghy. Yeah. So we got, we, we had to wait for that. Um, and we go onto the beach and there's probably like... 50 people just standing yeah, yeah. in this like line. By the way, th- th- nude beach. Uh, it wasn't a nude beach, but there was titties. I think, but you think, but I think it is implied that you can go there to be nude. Yeah, I mean, I mean, no one was naked. Yeah, they were. They had top off, but they're not naked. Oh yeah, but I'm saying like, I'm saying, but, but I think it's like, I think that's, you go, you go there like, and it's acceptable to do that in that area. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Uh, but there's like 50 people in a queue. We walk like, we come out, go past them, and then we're kind of like, "Oh shit!" Like this is this is a queue for the queue, boats. Yeah, okay. And a lot of Brits in this queue, by the way. So yeah. we obviously all, you know. But we're thinking got in line. like we straight away thought, you know, oh you you know you go get your boat that you got. Then we realised that it's literally one guy just going back and forth. So we're like, "Oh shit!" Okay, let's go back to the queue. Go to the back of the queue. We're behind Gary Cahill. Yeah. And then this guy who was dancing on the chair 
just walks out him his mate and two girls yeah. they're all holding these big bottles yeah they just walk past by the way all. yeah like it was clear that when we were at the meal that like, he was like the money man at the table you know yeah and then not not the whole place but, like he was like a money money man you know so he was kind of like which is fine that's good thing, good to do go have fun spend some money you know but just it gives you kind of context because i think he thought that he was better than everyone he thought he was sick yeah and like he just he, he just literally cut in line and everyone's like you can't do that so they went up to him and bear, bear in mind we have steve well the the girls the girls went like oh like I think this is a cue, and then mm. he kind of just carried on walking. They were like, oh, "We have to go with him." Yeah, yeah. So then he yeah. got to the front, and Vic's Vic's peppered at this point, and Vic starts going like, "No, nah, fuck this guy! No, nah, he's I skipped the cue. No, nah, let's go fight him. Let's fight him. Get him out here and get on the boat. Yeah, yeah. Steve, get him, get him." So Steve walks up and just goes like, "Bro, there's a cue," and he just he just looks at Steve and goes, "There is no cue." Yeah. So he's like, yeah, you're not getting on that boat. Like, yeah. there's these people, there's these people, there's these people, then there's us, yeah. then there's you. Yeah. And um, he's just he's just like, now nah, we prepaid. And we're like, he's like, pre uh, we prepaid. I got a flight to catch. And I'm like, number one, well, everyone's paid to go here. So that's why like everyone deserves, well, not deserves, yeah, everyone's in line to get, to get their dinghy back or whatever. And also, like, if you had a flight to catch, then leave earlier. It's not our fault. Like, leave earlier. You can't take a big bottle of whatever you're holding on a flight yeah yeah it was like, it was all just a lie it was like, a jet as well true yeah but it was all just a lie so steve's basically just like holding him like saying like you're not going on the boat comes back he tries to get on and steve just literally stops him well the funny part yeah the funny part is as well though that like, not even just that it's like the way the the way the boats came arrived they kept arriving like away from him anyway so it's like he would have had to walk really far to get to it so at that yeah. point like gary cahill and all the got on that one and then he went to like Every time the guy went near a boat, the other one would arrive at the other place. Yeah, and then we got an out. We got an hours, and then it started to almost get physical because he's like, at that point, he's literally there, like, oh, don't be, stop getting aggressive. And Steve's like, oh, trust me, I'm not being aggressive. Like this is just, yeah, this is easy. This guy is, by the way, he's he's probably like five ten, not not jacked. It's just and like not not we're just not Steve. Yeah, he's squaring <laughs> up to Steve, and Steve's just like, oh, no. and Everyone in our group starts getting a bit larry because he's being a dickhead. Yeah, and not by the way, we were also on the boat at that point. Yeah, we get on the boat and then we all just start like, come on then. And JJ was getting JJ was getting a little bit larry, and he was like, "Bro, just get to the fucking queue, go in the yeah, queue." Yeah, go yeah, in yeah, queue. yeah, yeah. He walks over, looks JJ square in the face, and he's like, "You have a small penis." Yeah, he was like, he was like, "You think you, he was like, you think you're all that? Like, you bet you got a small dick." Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then and then like um, and then like Steve's like actually like, like the, guy, the guy's starting to screw up a little bit to Steve, and Steve just gets on. Obviously, Steve's like job is to make sure no fights happen, so he's not gonna fight him. But like Steve gets on the boat. And then we're all leaving, and then everyone's just singing like, um, "Go cool, bye, nah, 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 yeah, nah, yeah." And yeah. then the, the, the guys just stood there as well, just going, He's just uh, small "For penis. those on audio, I'm, yeah, small I'm signifying small feelings." And, and, and to be fair, Vic was right, you know. Vic was like, "This guy probably wanted a, wanted a fight, so that if like he gets hit or something, he can be like, look, look, this is bad, this is bad.'" But I think the guy got more embarrassed that like, there was no fight. Yeah, and he was just stood on the boat. Everyone else who's in the queue just watching this guy just get like humbled a little bit. But it it, it, it might sound like we're stuck up on that, but honestly, it was just, it was just like a classic example of like a good British queuing system. Like, because we're in the queue, man. And now we, the reason I loved it was like, we we, like, we went like we didn't go to the front by the way. We we were just, we got in line. We had Steve. We could have taken the boat. <laughs> yeah, we yeah. could have gone first. Yeah, we got a queue. The reason I loved it was because like all of us, firstly, were on this same like we're all a little bit drunk. We're all going at this guy that is being a dickhead. Yeah, and we're also being like. We're understanding that the people in front of us, there's a queue. Like yeah, everyone yeah, knows yeah. how queue yeah. works, and they're getting involved. Yeah, yeah. Like um, one of the guys in the queue in front of us, I think he had stolen a pair of tongs from the restaurant. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And he's going up behind this guy, just using the tongs on his ear. <laughs> yeah. And the yeah. guy's still screwing up. Steve just going like, what the, what's this guy doing? <laughs> like flicking his ear. Yeah. And it was just, I don't know. It, it was, it was funny. Right? Everyone's sticking up to this like guy who was going to just, just trying to cheat the system and get in in the boat quicker. And it was, it, it was such a good amount of satisfaction I got knowing that his mate and the girls were so embarrassed yeah, because yeah. of him and yeah. he thinks that he's he thinks he's in the right yeah yeah but yeah it was it was a proper i'm him moment yeah it's like every day i had like a sick funny moment as well and that was definitely like that's just one of the most memorable parts of the trip probably yeah you know yeah that was that was a very good moment <laughs> yeah no it was, it was blue shirt yeah everyone calls him blue shirt that was funny man I, I, I don't know it's just like it's just annoying man but but then again, like I'm like, why are you getting annoyed? Like like, is you got a queue, but everyone's there. It's sunny. You're on a beach. You have got water on your feet. Just chill. Like yeah. Where are you? Where are you gonna go? That is better than here. Well, I guess it's flight. But again, like he didn't have a flight. He's lying. Yeah, if, even if you got on a flight, it's your own problem. 
you know. Maybe like, he'd come up. We all said if he'd come up and gone like, guys, oh, true, like, yeah. I have a flight. Can I get on? Is it all right if I go in front? No worries, mate. No worries. I need yeah. to. So, sorry, TikTok, TikTok clip of a guy doing that. You know, he just he just goes and pushes in, but just says like random things, and he sees who lets him in and who doesn't let him in. And then most people let him in. I'd let him in. Yeah. If he was, if he was talking like that. Sure. But even no excuse. He's like, oh, my mum my, 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 uh, just stole my cat. Can I, can I get in? And they're like, yeah, sure. <laughs> Like, as long as you say it in the right tone, they let you in. But um, what was your moment? The funniest moment of the trip. <sighs> so many funny moments. Uh, there's a moment on the trip where, like, well, I, there's one night, one morning where I woke up with, like, I couldn't swallow. And I had a really sore throat. And I thought it was either A, the shisha, but even though that, that night I didn't have a name, B, the alcohol. And I realized it was laughing. Like, on the way back to and back from one of the clubs, we were, me and Freeze were laughing. And I've never laughed that much. I think Josh as well. I couldn't see because my eyes was my eyes were crying. But it was like I won't go into why because it's just like inside jokes anyway. Like with, with not 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 you but like everyone, all of us. Um, but one of them was the the Riz, the, the, you know the the, yeah, the yeah. Riz. Yeah. Um, and yeah, it's just jokes, man. But that that would be the funniest moment. But also, the, the, we, we had, there's this clip of uh, LeBron James where he's like um, where uh, Marcus Rashford says like a, a story. Or a saying, but he butchers it, completely butchers <laughs> it, stutters halfway through, and doesn't make really much sense. You know, and then LeBron James goes, "That's my favorite saying. That's my favorite saying." You know, obviously it's not. So we we just kept saying that quote the whole way, whole way through, um, and it was just again funny. But I, I, honestly, I think the vibes were sick, man. I, I love the, the vibes. vibes were really sick. I think they they did slowly diminish throughout the trip. You think? Like the first couple of days, the vibes were like every car journey was literally like, all right. This is gonna be amazing. I thought, I thought that's what it was like the, the entire. They, they were still good. Like I, when I say this, it doesn't mean they're bad. Yeah, I'm just yeah. saying it. They like the first day. Yeah, everything was literally like a hundred percent. Yeah, yeah. It just it, yeah, yeah. It was very good though. Um, who was the drunkest? Who was the drunkest? Well, oh, Harry. Well, like, Harry. This question, I expected it to be Randy. Harry, no, really? Randy didn't. You didn't really get. I drank as much as I would normally drink, but I didn't get like. I yeah, you didn't go white girl wasted. I never really do that. I I I did, but not to the point I was passing out. Yeah. Harry did. Calix did. Calix did. Yeah. Harry and Calix probably got the most drunk. Ah, uh, definitely. Well, definitely Harry because he like just fucked himself yeah. one day. Um, maybe Calix. I'm trying to think, anyone else who got super drunk? But like, no one got like. Mitch. Oh, the first night we lost Mitch. Yeah, we lost him. His phone died. And we just lost him. He went out to go and get some food in the in the strip with a dead phone. Yeah, and just, just lost him. And then we all went back to, went back to the villa. And he just turned up. So, <laughs> just, hey guys. <laughs> yeah, it's, just, it's like KFC was banging. Um, I think like no one got like overly drunk other than Harry, but also no one got really no no one was like being boring. No, no one was, was being boring. It, the, literally who was the boring one? Oh, no, no, no boring one. I think everyone put like a, everyone put like a good shift in. Yeah. So what, what, I feel like you've got someone who you think. No, I'm trying. No, I'm trying to think. Just my worry is, you know, normally when when you say no one's the boring one, it means you were the boring one. No, no, no. You know, when no. it's like, oh, there's there's always the dickhead, and if you no. can't think of who it is, it's you. Well, you, I, you did more things than I thought you would do. Oh, but I didn't think. I, I, I thought you were not going to show up to poker. Well, I didn't want to. Oh. <laughs> This is the thing I hate. I hate. Uh, it's so annoying because JJ always does it, and JJ's like, oh man, you're boring. Like you know, you didn't go go karting. I'm like, bro, like. He literally said, "I'm not doing yoga." He doesn't drink. Like he doesn't want to do loads. Yeah. Now the good point was good though. Yeah, I, I was literally that. just like uh, I was asleep. Yeah, yeah. But no, the only reason I say poker is because you said you, you literally said I don't play poker. Yeah. That's the only reason. That's the only reason I said that one. Well, I said to Lachlan, and I was like, um, I was like, oh, why don't you go skydiving? He went, I don't want to. Oh, he agreed though. He shook. shook yeah, him. and I was like, like you don't want to go skydiving. I don't want to play poker. Yeah, like, yeah. But yeah. you're making me play poker, and he's like, oh, I'll go skydiving. And I was like, all right. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So now we're going skydiving in Australia. That's sick. That's very yeah. sick. Um, but no, there's no. There literally was no boring one. Everyone like went to pretty much like, like like no one, no one didn't do something that other people didn't do. If that makes sense. Like the, the, the no night one out sat out on their own. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The night out obviously was um was like, it was it was never planned. That that night out, the third one, or the second one was never planned. So a lot of people were like actually went really heavy first night. Went really heavy at Ocean Beach. So therefore, we'll have a break tonight so we can go out the next day. But then some a lot of us ended up going out anyway. Yeah, I mean that night was literally. That was after the boat day. Yeah. I was like, I ain't going out after this. Was it? No, sorry. It was after Ocean, Ocean Beach, Beach day. Yeah. I was like, I ain't going after this. I'm feeling rough. No, it was the boat day. You're right, actually. Uh, poker was the Ocean Beach day. 
Yeah, yeah, my bad. But anyway, it's all a blur. For, like, I, honestly, you know, but you, I know you said that the, the mornings were early, but it's like everything worked out perfectly time wise. Though, like, we went from literally one thing back home. If if we came back yeah, home, we no, should have shower. Like, good. yeah, shower ten minutes back out straight away. The timing was all good for that. I just mean like, for me, like the go karting was so early. Like, it was, was literally early, like yeah. leave at ten thirty, but I was like every day before that was get up at like nine. When yeah. we were going to bed at six. I think I slept like two, three hours every night. Yeah, and I can't do it. Yeah, yeah. I know yeah. you're used to it by now, but... Yeah, no, I'm, I'm weathered in that, man. I'm not. Yeah, yeah. But I mean, obviously, like, I'm not drinking when I'm doing that. But I, the thing is, it's like, it's it a perfect length, by the way, the trip. It's like four days. So it's like, there was there was not a time five days, where... Yeah, five, yeah it, was, it was like literally ended at the perfect time. Because everyone, everyone, everyone's like wanting more, but ready to go home. So it's like, it didn't drag and it wasn't too soon. It was like literally perfect time, man. Yeah, is it the kind of stag you'd go for? Yeah, well, like, well I did a stag. My what stag was say? like just uh, we went to burger place, <laughs> mini golf, poker night. Oh, I did poker night. Yeah, but um, I would. I mean, at that point, I wasn't really gonna do a whole weekend like that. But I would. Yeah, that's fucking sick stag. Now that, like, ever since JJ said on sidecast what he would do, yeah, that's what I'm like. Oh, I would do that if I did one. Would you do one like this? Uh, maybe I just like to have the best time the music just needs to be well you can you can you can choose the music yeah but I can't choose I can't, I can't go oh Ibiza you have to play this no but you can <laughs> go just go somewhere that's not Ibiza yeah you, 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 so you're that you do what you want you know yeah but like the one JJ described of you know like you just get a house you have like massages a chef a seven aside match yeah yeah you have like I don't know, you land set up so you yeah. can just play like <laughs> fucking S and D or whatever. You should know. you should still do one. You should do it after stag. Can you do a stag do after you're married? We all said you can because yeah, we want. Go on. Yeah, yeah. Does that count? Yeah. Surely I should just go like, oh, I'll do a birthday weekend. Yeah, but, but like, again, the reason I think this was so good is because like, because it was a stag, like everyone turns up because you don't want to like, you, you, it's all, we did it for Vic, so we're all there for Vic. So it's like if if someone's not taking part, it's not like oh they're just gonna chill. It's more like well you know it's nice to just show up for Vic. So that's why if you do this. In, but it's, you have it as a stag, then everyone will put their put a shift in. Whereas if you like, oh, I should just go out for a weekend, everyone will be like, oh, you know. Yeah. But you should do one, man, do one. Do a birthday and stag. If people can renew their vows, you can have a delayed stag. For sure, man. <laughs> and also it's like, like yeah, it's just, you're, you're just like crept up in the end as well, like the wedding wise. Like in terms of, because with Vic, when this was planned, like, I feel like when this was first mentioned, I don't think you would have been able to do one that quick, would you? Stag wise. What do you mean? Like, I don't know what I mean. But it's not too late. You can do one for sure. Would you trust Freezy to do one for you? Yeah, I would. Freezy, Freezy, like, really, he made it very, you know, oh, there's a couple of things here that, are, you know, take the piss out of it. But ultimately, it, it was... It'd be hard for anyone to top it, I think, like, organisation-wise. I mean, I, I would honestly say most people would say, like, Freezy, can you do that? Can you do mine? Can you do mine? Can you do mine? He's, he's, he's going to be hot. He might start business now. Or organising stacks. <laughs> I um, reckon he won't do it again. People were like, nah, man, this is, this is it, too much. It was sick, though. Like, it turned out really nice. Uh, yeah, yeah. So, but as I, in, like, it, I can imagine for him, he's like, he put a shift because he's on him as well. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's his responsibility. Yeah, yeah. So, where it's like, oh, okay, this is now happening. All right. And a lot of stuff went wrong and stuff. Like, the boat pulled out last second. Um, yeah. Some of the night outs almost didn't happen. Um, but no, I think he did a sick job. And he'll do another one, and everyone will go, oh, the last one was a bit better. Yeah, that's a problem. It's just like it's not. Well, that's, it's that's weddings as well. Weddings gonna be like that now as well. I, I wish that. Um, I was gonna say. I wish that. No, yeah, we were saying we want everyone to get engaged now, so we can do more stags. And then, and then we were saying what 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 we should do is right, people should get engaged, then call it off. So get, get, <laughs> get engaged, go on a stag, and then call it off. Get engaged. Yeah. But by the way, what we'll say is having nice. the having the wedding, your wedding, and then this in like space of like two weeks was sick though. Because, like, it really, like, I feel like it brought everyone together, which hasn't been happening Harry said that to me when he was drunk. He was like, yeah, I feel like since your wedding, I feel like all the guys have been a lot closer. Well, I feel like, not going to lie, I feel like recently it's been very tense in that group. Everyone's been, like, especially in the group chat, everyone's just been, like, insulting each other, being like, da-da-da, da-da-da-da-da. Well, this actually, like, brought everyone together. Because we were calling each other washed. Yeah, we're, like, as a group, we're washed. Yeah. You guys haven't really got time to go on holiday and hang out properly as a group. Yeah, not outside of like work. It's just all banter. That's what it probably is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah nice. Get that, sick man. This is an advertisement from BetterHelp Therapy Online. 
So obviously, BetterHelp is a way that you can actually speak to someone. It's really important to do that if you're already busy, if you're caught up in life, uh, you need to take a minute just to talk and clear your mind. You can do that with a professional and someone who is not going to judge you on things like your friends would or people that you know would, you know? It's so easy to get caught up in what everyone else needs from you and never take a moment to think about what you need from yourself. Yeah, and again, sometimes you just need that time for yourself. You know, and rather than talking to the mirror, you can talk to someone who actually can give you input and uh, respond to you. But when we all spend our time giving, it can leave us feeling stretched out and burned out. Therapy can give you the tools to find out to find more balance in your life so you can keep supporting others without leaving yourself behind. And with over 1,000 therapists in the UK already, BetterHelp can provide access to mental health professionals with a wide variety of expertise in mental health. And our listeners can get 10% off their first month at betterhelp.com slash what's good. That's B-E-T-T-E-R-H-E-L-P dot com slash what's good. Well, while we were there, yeah. uh, that last day, I think you were at golf. Yeah. I was on my phone. Yeah, chilling on the, the couch and sorry I just opened a drink and I saw that the Sidemen video hit 100 million views Woo! Bop, 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 bop. first ever video to hit 100 million views yeah sick I mean the next one is like yeah 20, 23 million away so yeah it's cold I don't think that's getting there cold cold is it the video we thought would hit 100 million what did you think it would be I mean once it started getting to 90 million yes yeah yeah of course, but of course. when we made it no no what what did you think would be then? Like if that makes sense. I thought a Tinder. Really? Yeah. I feel like a Tinder's just because it's also not that long. Like that video is, it's like two hours or something. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's always a video that people like always bring up, isn't it? That's like, people people say that's the best as well. They hold it as like the best, right? Yeah. I mean, it's it would be in my top three definitely. Yeah. So, so. Yeah. The more and more I talk about the uh, road trip though across America, yeah. The more I realise I'd probably put that in my top three videos. Really? That's why JJ's naked, half of it. That's why. Oh, yeah, nice. <laughs> nice. <laughs> nice. Now, the American road trip, that holiday video, and the Raka Raka video. Yeah, yeah, Those yeah. Those three are like my favourite Sidemen videos. You know, yeah, then. yeah. Look at that. Washed, you're washed, man. And Sidemen, Manchester Meet was the lowest amount of views. I was going to say, the, two of those videos, obviously Raka Raka is a skit. Yeah. The other two, I'm on the bad team for at least oh, sure. like the majority. And it is, it's the, that's where you get the best like experience yeah yeah yeah. This was more fun. You, you, you're on the bad team for this the stag but actually i'd argue i could have been the good team yeah no the stag one was a bit of a stain crown with me it's the stag video yeah <laughs> no one knew what team they were on i we tried were the cheap team we and got you know, private he, jet the he really minute. tried as well he like really tried huh harry really tried that video to, make, to organize a good stag well he only organized his half no, that's what i mean that's, so like the stag he tried to make it a good one. Oh yeah yeah, flopped it. Yeah, went to feed ducks and there's no ducks in the pond. But yours was uh, it was meant to be cheaply expensive. Okay, so I don't really know how feeding ducks is the expensive tea. Mm. Yeah, true, actually, it was true. a bit weird. True, although the boat at the end was the expensive part. Sorry, the boat was expensive. Yeah, part. but the it, was boat wasn't, it wasn't as expensive as the private jet. Oh yeah, true. Yeah, well, yeah, maybe yeah. Or shutting down a theme park. Yeah, you guys are probably more expensive. Yeah, actually, probably was. What is your biggest theory then on why it hit 100 mil? That one in particular. What's what's the thing? Why did that hit 100 mil? I think, I mean, I just think in terms of content, it is the best video because the good team are genuinely so happy to be there because that in that time we were like, all right, this isn't just a video. You know, if I'm on the good team, I firstly I don't want to be on the bad team and know my friends are all having the best time of yeah. their lives. Yeah. Secondly. You're like, okay, we have to film a video. All I've got to do is enjoy myself, get a massage, yeah. have a nice meal. So they're all super gassed. Our team was, who's it? It's me, Vic, and Ethan. And we go to Benidorm. We're all, I think it's because also we're in a very good, like we have very good energy yeah. in that. Yeah. Normally the bad team can get annoyed. Yeah. Uh, we all drank. We go around Benidorm, which is a place we never thought we'd go. Yeah. It's just, I don't know. I don't think there's like a boring moment in it. I think also it's like one of, it was one of the early like videos of that concept too, right? Yeah. So that, that helps as well. And then yeah, also I think once sure. it starts getting like, a lot of views, it's just, those kind of videos just carry anyway. Like, you know, a video, a video that's on like 60 million views is probably got for a reason. So it's probably going to keep climbing, 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 you know? Yeah. So at that, that point, obviously it's going to be hard to drop a new one that goes that high unless it just bangs. And also it's kind of, kind of early on in you guys doing Savage Sundays anyway, right? Yeah. If you look at if you look at the total time yeah, scale, in, yeah, in, in the grand schemes of things, it is. Yeah, but also, yeah, we had just 
the Benidorm team was just like free time. So we yeah. were it, we were able to just get content of us being us. I do think that, I with think that, a bit of structure. I think, yeah, I think because now you got more pressure to like maintain the levels and do like certain things and please people like the fans and stuff. That like, I think it's easily forgotten that the reason you guys make such good videos is just because you just be yourselves or like you just run around with vlog cameras and what happens happens. But nowadays, I'm including myself in this. I'm not trying to like shit on them. Yeah. Firstly, we make it too structured. This was like the bad team for this. Josh went. Here's ten things. Go. Yeah, like yeah. you could go to bed at four a.m. if you want. You could you do go it. do it in ten minutes and be done. Yeah, but we were just like, let's have a sick night. Yeah, we did them all. Secondly, we all vlogged ourselves. Yeah, did we have cameramen on that trip? We had no cameramen. Yeah, we had yeah. one security guard and us three. Yeah, and nowadays, I mean, I know John hates it. No one touches a vlog camera. But I think, oh, uh, man, uh, and I encourage it. I always but yeah, I think, yeah, I think yeah, that's yeah. because you have the cameraman, though. Huh? Yeah, it's because you have the camera guys to sort it Oh, out. yeah. But it's also like. like if you didn't, you'd know you have to do vlog. You have thought, to. Uh, yeah. Yeah. It's the thought of like running around, like, oh, I've got to go film myself. Yeah. Like, that's, I can't be me because then I'm going to have to go, fuck it. Hey, guys, we're doing this. But then, like, but then you were, though. Like, you were yourselves. Yeah, 100%. Because you have to. But it was more new and exciting when it, like. Yeah, I get that. We yeah. have done stuff. We have done this for a long time. Yeah, yeah. It's always going to happen. Yeah. But we did do a video recently that we had to vlog ourselves. Yeah. Meme Olympics. Oh, sick. I think it's gone out It's gone out this weekend. Sick. Is uh, it good? I'm, I'm interested to see. It hasn't gone out yet by the time we're filming this. Yeah. I'm interested to see how it does because it's a very different concept. Meme Olympics. What, what, was, what was that like? Vic took it. It was He hosted. Yeah. And he gave us a task. We went to Brighton. We were in yeah. pairs. Me and oh. Will. Me and Will. I think it was Ethan and Harry. Josh and... Toby, yeah. I think those are the three pairs. Jay, okay. wasn't it? Yeah. And he goes, all right, you have to go find a ginger person and do a shot with them. Yeah. Go. Six. First six. one back gets a gold. Second. Oh, nice. And yeah, we just yeah, go it, do it. Going and coming back. Going and coming yeah. back. Nice. Firstly, exhausting. Yeah. I bet hot, I'm, <laughs> hot day. That's what I'm saying as well. Yeah. Hot day. Yeah. And uh, yeah, it, it's interesting because it's like. A lot of the times we're like, all right, let's try and just get the task done rather than uh, the content. Yeah. And admittedly, we probably should just go content at 100%. Yeah, yeah. But we're all competitive. Yeah, no, you are. You yeah. are. So that makes like, it fun now. One of them, he goes, um, you have to find you have to find someone who is a grandma. Mm -hmm. You have to tell, you have to compliment them. You have to have prove it. You have to just, you have to actually make, like, you have to ask them. Yeah. Like, you can't just go to an old person and go. How's it work there? So, hello, hello. Are you a grandparent? Yeah, you look nice. So, uh, well, we run out of this building. Harry and Ethan go right. They immediately find an old person and go, you're a grandparent. They say, yeah, he yeah. say that. Yeah. I literally just run into the road and I go, is anyone here a grandma? <laughs> and But I don't know if I even filmed it well. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. And one yeah. woman just goes, oh. and raises her hand, like really frail. Yeah. And I'm just like, you look lovely today. And then Josh and Ethan run, uh, Josh and Toby run over and talk to her. Yeah, I'm like, I did it. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> so yeah, yeah, I run back yeah, in. Yeah, and it's yeah. like I probably cool. should have gone over, but did you yeah. get our camera? Well, I turned the camera around, but I'm filming from like probably like 20 yards away. So <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. that's really good. It's out now, like yeah, sun the Sunday. Yeah, so. yeah, see, yeah. See, see. But yeah. Interested to see how it does because if it does well, it's a cool concept to try it's again. It's a bit yeah. of a different format than usual, isn't it? Yeah, it's just very fast paced. Yeah, it's good try but again, like probably the reason why that video did so well because it was like a fresh, ad fresh idea at the time. So it's like this, this could be the next fresh idea. Tinder obviously was like yeah. We got to throw out like ten of them. Yeah, man. Like and one of them might do well. Yeah, yeah. Then we rinse that. Yeah, you got yeah. Like it's, it's, it's funny, man. Like and like twenty versus one, it's like, become like a series now. So the Sick. rating YouTubers and YouTubers. yeah, 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 yeah. We need but to do I'm, the reverse still. Yeah, of of us doing you YouTube. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll do that as well. <laughs> That's interesting. Yeah, I feel like I feel like. I was like unsure if that one would do. I mean, it got one out of ten, but it didn't drop, right? Mm. But I, I, I'm like, I'll be honest. I was kind of like thinking it wasn't going to do very well, only because it's like obviously the reason the first one did so well is because you guys ranked yourselves, which is interesting. But then like, I don't know. I feel like people would want to see you guys more. I knew, I knew it wouldn't stay one because it was against twenty v one. Yeah, G, but yeah, yeah. It's still, still like four. Yeah, that's a funny video, man. Yeah, very funny. Well, uh, we've also confirmed speed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because he did the kickups, right? He did. Yeah. And he did them easy. I've heard that he's getting better at football. Yeah. A lot better. I think he's always been, like, not as bad as he is. Because yeah. if you watch any video of him, he'll still miss the ball. Yeah. 
And I'm like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Bro's still, bro's still good. But I think it's really, I think it has also improved. So I called JJ out on this. Yeah. I don't know if you've seen this. No. JJ said, you can play in the charity match if you can do 20 keepy ups. Yeah. I then said, JJ can't say this because he can't do 20 <laughs> keepy ups. On sidecast, got him to do it. He had, I think it was his fourth attempt. Yeah, something like that. He Get got 20. 20. But okay, the first yeah. attempt, he got one. Okay. Second, he got like 14. Yeah. Third, he got one or two yeah. and then next one he got 20. 20 but like it hit off a TV and he had to like oh, okay, get yeah. a touch just <laughs> yeah, to yeah. 20th to be fair sometimes, sometimes you're like I don't know you have like the wrong shoes on what shoes are you wearing he, he took his shoes off, off. oh yeah. that's probably why well he tried it with his shoes on and it just fl- like flicked away okay, 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 okay but yeah I'm so excited for the charity match yeah it's really sick I just uh, just want it. I, I just want it to go as well as the last one yeah but if, if, you, if you overthink that too much it, it won't because you're holding it to that regard yeah, and the last one, the, the, the reason the reason why the last one probably did so well is because you didn't do it for three years, and you had no, you had nothing to compare it to as of late, you know. Yeah, so and if, it was if, coming out of the pandemic as well. Yeah, yeah. So if you compare, if you compare it too but much, the last one was so perfect. But you got now, you got now, you got to stop saying that now. Like it wasn't, it wasn't the time, but now you got to be like, last one was was last one. Let's focus on the new one because if you, if yeah. you keep comparing it, you're just gonna be like, oh, it, it, even if it wasn't something might be different, but it's not as bad. It's, it's just different. You'll think, oh, it's bad because it's different. So I think it's got to be like it's a new game, new year. Different. It's got different, 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 different teams. Maybe different stadiums. Da, 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 this is how it's going to go. But yeah, we need to know if anyone has any uh, recommendations in the comments down below. Who would you, if you had to pick one person, John? Who would you pick? To be in, to the, be in the in the match. Who uh, like wasn't there last year? I guess right. Yeah. Who wasn't there? Or I'm going to go Kai or XQC. Let's bring a few more streamers in. Okay. Well, well XQC has been diving around his bedroom. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> By the way, I love that clip. You know when Josh reacting to him because. Um, Josh reacts to it, and then XQC reacts to Josh reacting to it, and then like I look, that's why, that's why you don't like you do not, you, you don't like his stream as much, do you? XQC what? stream. I love his streams. Oh, Okay, okay. I thought you said that's I thought it's what you and Carl are saying. No. Oh, okay. okay. Carl said it. I think. Oh. I love XQC. I yeah, think he's he, sick. He's go. So he's just he's just there. Me and Lannan were talking about how he's because he's obviously so XQC's moved to kick hundred mil. Yeah. We'll and we were literally like, yeah, he deserves it. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, bless, bless. Yeah. So he's, he's watching Josh react, and he goes, "Bro's got waves." And he just starts talking about Josh's hair for like five minutes. That's why his streams are so sick, though, isn't it? Because like nothing, random stuff happens, and you just get clipped. And that part is so yeah. But it, it, but then now, as you see, hundred mil move to kick. Yeah. And a non-exclusive to quit. Non-exclusive as well for yeah. two years. So, so he'll just have to do extra hours, basically. Yeah. On yeah. kick. Which Cold is, man. That's nuts. And also, I keep seeing people on Twitter. I've not read too. Much, I've read a bit. Um, but my, my signal went on the plane. But I was seeing people like saying that like. Oh, they're never gonna recoup this. It's stupid. But like, it doesn't matter. It's not like it's not a cost they're trying to recoup. They won't recoup that. They'll they'll, they'll make a hundred mil over time. Well, I think that he's not getting a hundred mil. Oh, I think he's getting a hundred. I may be completely wrong, and maybe be chat shit. But I think he gets a hundred mil. But a part, of, a huge part of that is to bet on stake. Yeah, it could be. Yeah, and then he yeah. won't get to keep it. Yeah, like yeah. afterwards, he'll get to keep any winnings he gets. But even still, say, but even still, he's probably getting a lot of money to go. Yeah. So, I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm saying more like the he'll he'll attract like maybe he's getting hundred mil, but I, yeah, yeah, that's yeah. I yeah. But he'll attract so many more people. Look at how many people are like talking about it now as well on Twitter, on YouTube. It's like a huge story. So like that in itself is like warranting the purchase of him or of his contract to be streaming on Kick. And, and to be fair, Kick actually are doing like they're doing well. They don't even need to do much because Twitch just take themselves down. Twitch is, yeah, Twitch are really they just keep right saying now. like, oh, by the way, we're doing this, which fucks you over. Yeah, and then like they've added a new 70-30 split in, which YouTube already has anyway, and Kick has 95 anyway on subs. And then they, to get that, you have to have 350 subs per month on a three-month consecutive basis, not including Gifted or Prime, which is really hard. Yeah. That's actually really hard. Yeah. And at that point, if you have that... Gifted and Prime not being in it is outrageous. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then, I mean, I get it, but it's just like... And, and it could be a good thing. It's, it's a nice incentive, but it's just like... I don't know. I feel like, I feel like, I feel like Twitch have been too kind of... We're the best, you know? And we're, yeah. we're, we, are the, we are the pedigree and the leader of like gaming and, and kind of like street live streaming. YouTube are YouTube. They're never the YouTube stream is never really going to take over Twitch because it's just a different different platform. Yeah, but then Kick comes through, and Kick is pretty much just like a, just just Twitch, and they're just, they're just, they're just, and then obviously their goal <laughs> at Twitch at Kick is probably to promote stake. Be honest, so it's like their goal is not even to they can just do they can do everything that Twitch can't do very well because they don't care. Like Twitch must have like internal like we can't do this, we can't do that. Kick just don't care, so they'll do everything that Twitch can't do 
and just do it. Yeah. And the community are like, well, that, if, I think kick kick for small streamers is so much better at the start because they're just earning more money. Yeah. And, I mean, and even for big streamers, realistically. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I mean, it seems like it's just better in general. Yeah. It's yeah. just the the only thing for like the reason I'm not there is purely if I move, would people come over? Yeah, but I think I think I think I think that's an important part of the way for a lot of people. I think what they should be doing. I I, I don't think anyone out there should be putting their eggs into one basket in terms of like. Remember that the streamers are the are the. Um, I guess you are. Well, I say I say you as in the streamer. You are the reason people watch you, right? So you shouldn't rely on YouTube or Twitch or Kick or whatever to actually be your brand obviously you have followers there yeah but i'm saying you have to have your own audience you have to cater to your audience and community and you have to put work in to build your community rather than relying on these platforms so obviously like if you've got 100k on twitch and you've got 10k on kick you're obviously not gonna get as many viewers but if you have an actual dedicated viewership and a dedicated audience they will move regardless because they're watching you for a reason yeah it's just certain people have like proper habits to go on twitch yeah 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 no like, yeah, of course of course i i haven't actually ever gone on kick yeah, yeah purely because i just like it's just habit i load twitch and if there's not someone i like on there there might be someone i like over on kick but i just i don't go on there for but, some yeah, reason yeah yeah but if you if you if you have actually if someone who's the streamer is like a really sick community and you're part of that you'll go you you would go right if you if you have if you have someone that you all yeah, love watching you have to be yeah we don't watch that stream streams that much i watch streams no but i'm saying you know, you're, not, you're not like in one person's chat like every day so uh, when, whenever yeah. but i was like say like say like when when xcc goes live yeah. And like the people who watch it every every minute of every stream. Like yeah. Kind of people. I mean, I'm in like FIFA Kill stream. Yeah, yeah. Literally like five hours a day. Okay, that's sick. Yeah. I just need to get one. I remember you also used to watch um, these Dons, uh, Dead by Daylight. You're the yeah, flat. I used to watch, yeah. <laughs> that was a long time ago. And, and there were different people, but I also thought the same guy. Oh, yeah. Because they're the same green screen in the corner. Big beard, man. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I did better. Yeah, I didn't watch it much. Yeah. It was just yeah. on background. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, um, kick. Give me some money. <laughs> I, I mean, obviously, a lot of people are like, a lot, a lot of people are skeptical because like Aiden is like a big face of it, um, and he says controversial things, and Kick do controversial things as well. But I don't know. I feel like it's, 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 this day and age, that stuff works marketing wise. Like, look at what's this? I don't, wanna, I don't want to Mizzy. Yeah. You know? Like he, he, like obviously everything he's doing is really annoying, but he knows that he's playing his card right because he's just getting out there, and sadly that's what gets views. <laughs> Crazy shit. I saw, um, I got like two TikToks over the last week of Aiden Ross basically giving people stuff. Yeah. One was his, he went to his bodyguards. This could be really old, but he went to his, I think it was like his bodyguard was having a baby or something like with his girlfriend, wife, whatever. Yeah. Or like his boyfriend's brother or something like that. Yeah. And he just walks around and he's basically like, like, thanks for accepting me into the family kind of thing. Here's 10 grand. Mad. To go to the next person. I got yeah. ten grand for you too. Yeah. I got ten grand for you too. Yeah. <laughs> Stuff like that. And then one that was new is I don't know the guy's name, but there's a streamer who uh Aiden's talked to before or something that's, that was a big fan of Aiden. Yeah. And Aiden just turns up at his house, gives him like a sign LeBron uh ball. Yeah. And basically goes, You're now officially like signed to kick. Did he give him 10 grand as well? I didn't see that like part, him and his, his mum. He's with his mum, yeah. Yeah, I saw that one. I think I saw yeah. that one. He's literally just like, yeah, you are now signed to kick. Yeah. You're going to get paid hourly. every month, like, hourly. Uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I, I thought, uh, that's sick as well, by the way. Like, yeah. yeah. All the comments are just like, I don't even like Aiden, but this is a huge dub. Yeah. I don't know. I feel like, I, I mean, I don't know. People, people he, he just say crazy shit sometimes, but. But they're, they're doing the right, they're doing the right thing yeah, in yeah. terms of moving like kick is actually dubbing up i think at first everyone thought oh man like it's just like another copy or another streaming site it's gonna fail but they actually are really smart from what they're doing and then you know well, it went it went from copy to just outrageous and it's like you only go to kick if you want to say stuff that should, yeah like, yeah yeah and but then now they're also actually getting rid of that i think, I think yeah. also i think it got a little bit like i think that got a little bit out of hand because i think people that that started spreading it still wasn't the case they're still banning people they're still like getting rid of people but they were maybe allowing a little bit more you yeah. know um but also now they just, they, just are, they just are making it better for streamers and then at the end of the day like all these platforms youtube youtube the reason youtube killed the game honestly is because the partner program that's the only reason they actually went crazy because they, they, they're saying and that's what that's what a partner program is 
That's what an affiliate is. You know, you literally promote our our website, like YouTube, and in return, we'll give you a split of their yeah. earnings. So that's why YouTube went so big, and that's why people want to make YouTube videos. It's the same on Twitch. The people the people want to stream because they want to earn a living. And and I think I think recently Twitch Twitch have been a bit more like, okay, we're the reason you guys have got a career. The, yeah, hundred percent. When actually not, nah, the streamers are the reason you guys have got a website. You yeah. know, and then um, Kit come come through, and they just Kit, Kit just make everything beneficial for the streamer. And even if they're losing money on their end, they'll make it back somehow with their scheme or whatever they're planning. But at least the person streaming who has got to work and have to got, got to pay rent, pay their bills, is getting more of that cut than they would be on Twitch. Well, they also, like, Twitch is owned by Amazon. Yeah, yeah. So as much as, you know, you could go like, oh, you know, the streamers are the ones that made Twitch. Yeah. Amazon don't care, bro. Yeah, and, and also, that's what get. Like, they Amazon, don't need. They don't need anyone. They don't I, need Twitch. They yeah. could shut it down yeah, tomorrow. Just, I, Amazon should just subsidize it all. Amazon should just like, take a loss on Twitch, but make it up in another way. Like, yeah, a link. It, I don't. I don't know if it's got Amazon Prime, but link it in other ways, man. I don't know how, but like, make it make it like a sick connection. Well, like, it used to be that really sick thing of like, well, it wasn't that sick, but you could watch an Amazon Prime thing, and if your subs have Amazon Prime, watch with you. They could watch it with that's you. Sick. Yeah, but then that just disappeared. Yeah, and then Amazon Prime also got football matches well yeah and i remember being hit up about they were like oh do you want to watch this match yeah but it was like stoke versus forest or something Whoa. something rubbish yeah yeah and yeah. i was kind of there like not really but i could be down it's, yeah. a, it's a cool thing to do i can just watch football on stream yeah and then they were like okay well you're not allowed to swear you're not allowed to talk badly about anything that yeah. happens and i'm like all right so if a the commentator says something stupid. I'm can't not laugh at him. Can't yeah, laugh yeah, at yeah, him. Yeah, 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 yeah. And there was just so many things. I have to, I have to stop before the game and at halftime to do like a shout out to thank Amazon. Yeah. And I was like, this is a brand deal. Without all you want to do is watch football, and that's it. But and you'll still yeah. promote them by doing that because yeah. they'll be in the corner everywhere. So I'll still, I'll still be like, even if they just said, you have to just say, I'm watching an Amazon Prime. Yeah, yeah. Just that. I'm at Ronkey as well, by the way. <clears throat> so I'm not change the subject too much. Um, I saw Pokemane saying that, like, because there's this thing going around, and it's true, I think, where that, like, kick is run off Twitch, right? Like, apparently, like, the player or, and, like, the way the infrastructure works is the same as Twitch. I mean, it does. Can you load kick quick? But I, th I, 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 I'm, and again, I might be wrong here, but I think what, what I think what it is, I think like Amazon uh, web services, like, like the servers, I think they, I don't know, they, they host on kick. But obviously, it's not, it's not a case that, like, I mean that is Twitch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of, of course. <laughs> yeah, of course. Visually, but I, I'm I'm saying more like obviously like if if, if um, Kick was solely ran on Twitch's like infrastructure, Twitch can just shut it down then. But that's not the case. They can't do that. Yeah, so it can't I mean, be that. Got, there's viewers on there, mate. Uh, well, they literally had to. Did you see Kick went down? No. They had to, um, as DJ Khaled would say, ban on servers because they got 50 times their their users went up by 50 times. Mad. They, they, apparently, they've, apparently, they've, they, they're actually seeing. Actually, sees cake. They cake them. Can you go on? What's something I watch? I don't know, uh, I'm just, I'm trying to think of any games. Overwatch. What? Oh, Warzone's there actually. Okay, three thousand viewers. I watch. I watch more Warzone. Do you? When yeah, you watch cards, FIFA. You? Yeah, yeah, yeah. FIFA but, kill. But is, is, is it not the game FIFA? I th I thought he would have moved on to like um, like ranked and shit. He plays ranked Warzone. Do you play Warzone? No. I just watch it. I don't like watch him. Like I don't, yeah, yeah, sometimes yeah. I do just actually watch it, but yeah. a lot of the time I'll just have a stream up and I'll like play Overwatch. I might watch it because I, I miss uh, I miss Warzone. Well, he went through, uh, the reason I watched a lot of him was because he- You still to get on here, by the way. Yeah, 100%. Yeah. I, the reason I watched a lot of him was recently was because he was doing ranked yeah. and he got to, he was third in the world. He isn't real, and he's literally just there. Like he was averaging. I think he he did something like he averaged thirteen hours a day. Wow. For like wow. two months, wow. or something stupid like that. Yeah, yeah. I was like, this is more than fucking people that do subathons. Yeah, 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 yeah. True, true, true. Literally, <laughs> this is just a, like a nuts amount. Just north, yeah, hours. yeah, yeah, yeah. Although, although, look, GTRP. I should do. Um, I should bring Don Dolph back only on kick. Yeah, I should do actually. But yeah, no, this is nuts. I I never actually like taken much time to. You know, I love how it's like just green, like it's just like yeah. <laughs> as in like, well, it doesn't make any difference. But I'm saying like the purple on Twitch is just green now. On yeah, cake, you know. So this is the so revenue split. Nine yeah, ninety five. Yeah, five affiliate status. You can get it with fewer requirements. Gambling so content you can do. Uh, it's creative. I mean, saying it's creative friendly doesn't mean much. I remember that 
a lot of people on Twitch were seventy thirty, right? With like revenue. Were they? Yeah, like someone had someone. Some people had like contracts, and I thought that was partner. I thought I thought partners get seventy thirty. No, partners get fifty fifty. I, so I, th- I thought yeah, I thought affiliates at fifty fifty and partner is seventy thirty. The bigger creators get seventy thirty. Yeah, yeah. And then they limited that now with the hundred k thing or whatever. But then also that so like, I don't really get the difference between partner and affiliate then because like you work so hard, get partner, you just get badge. Yeah, and go to that's, it. that's it, and have a badge again. Yeah, that's I it. Thought, yeah, I thought like you should like get something. Yeah, and I think that's why that's a lot of, a lot of people stay who for the got a lot of people who actually got affiliate or partner or whatever. Yeah, thought that was a thing as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. and then they found out it wasn't. Yeah, and I, th- I think also I think that because it's so hard to get affiliate and then so hard to get a partner on Twitch, that's probably why the people stay more because they're like, I've worked so hard to get partner, why would I leave now? But yeah. I don't know. I mean, I mean, if Twitch can bring it back, then cool. But I'd love to move to Kick, but. Why would I? I don't know. You have to move. But you could just do both. You just sometimes stream on Kick, sometimes is, stream on Twitch. Like, at this point, though, I'm literally streaming enough to, like, I stream twice in the last like three weeks. That's just like, you could do you could you could do one React stream on Kick. See yeah, but you did get married and then go on a stag do. So. Yeah, but like my reasoning for streaming now is like, firstly, I do enjoy it, but secondly, I get videos for my clips channel. So I don't have that much time to just kind of yeah like. I would don't just sit and play games anymore. But I mean, when you do the Twitch, do you edit for the reacts? Uh, sorry, for the clips channel on VOD, or do you record it? VOD. VOD. Okay. I was gonna say you could just do one and then on kick. See how it goes. But I guess you want to interact with them, don't you? On kick. Yeah. When you're reacting, I guess you're not interacting as much. No, I react. A, I interact a lot. Oh, sick then. Yeah. Bless, bless. Nice, nice. um, I was gonna say that um, I think you should do a stag <laughs> <laughs> or a birthday. Uh, same thing actually, because he's birthday boy. So everyone's right, cool. It's also Josh's birthday around my birthday. Nah, he can do his own. Do, do a joint birthday. Go do a joint, bir- do a joint birthday. Nah, but he's very. He would have a very different. Okay. Idea. Well, then do, do. We'll do a trip. Okay. Find a place that you both like. Could agree on like a location, and then one day is him, one day is you, or two days is him, one day is you. So you get to do whatever you want in those two days, and he gets to do whatever he wants in those two days. What about a, a land party at a massive villa somewhere? I'm going to tell you some information after this. Okay. Oh. It's nothing, Matt. It's just, you'll go. Oh, okay. Yeah. Bless. Yeah. The dates. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's all. That, you, as in, think about the dates. Yeah, I know, I know. I know. Yeah. But it's not going to happen. happen. It doesn't happen on your birthday. True. It can be just for True. your birthday. You know? True. Do it in, mate, do it in December. <laughs> I can't delay my birthday by two months and a stag do by like a year. You're a busy man. Ah, huh? you're a busy man. Busy man. Are you doing a honeymoon? Yes. And that's being delayed. No, a honeymoon doesn't always have to be straight after. No, it's a birthday party. No, it's a stag. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> okay, I'll have my I'll have my twenty first birthday party next week. Uh, yeah. Twenty <laughs> first. We're a big fucking sashel. <laughs> sashel. Sash. Sash. Okay. Hit a sash. He did. It went really, really small. <laughs> yeah, I think it was Lux. Lux just did it up, so it was tiny. Um, yeah, I think that's it. I think that's it. Honestly, I'm sorry if this has been terrible, but we, as I said, we we're, came we're both hung over straight after. Yeah, both knackered. Yeah, I was. Just, we were in David. The uh, we were inside David Guetta last night, <sighs> and um, it was good. That's man. exactly how it sounds. And uh, it, I was just. It got to about four. Yeah, I just. I was looking at the clock. I was like. I know we have to get up. Yeah, yeah. In four hours. Mate, I did not set an alarm, right? And I just randomly woke up at eight o'clock. I don't know how I did That's that. lucky. Yeah, especially because I went to bed really late anyway. Five. Actually, you know what the funniest moment was? Josh getting left. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. So we have three cars driving those places, and um, we're all in them, and we're all left. And then, like, you're in a different car to me, right? At that point. Yeah, we were yeah. like 20 minutes away from you, the We room. set off. For, I, I, he didn't understand that. I was like, 15, 20 minutes gone. There's a group in the chat saying, You man left me. <laughs> it's just, you man left me. <laughs> Everyone's creasing. It's because everyone w- would have assumed that he was in their car. So, well, like my car was full. So yeah, you'd have thought, oh, just so we the had car. we had like, well, we had fourteen people, and there was, I think there was like fifteen seats or something. Yeah, like. yeah, yeah. So it's like one car was always gonna have a space. Yeah, but like my car was full, so I'm thinking he's can't he can't come in here. Yeah, yeah. He's in one of the others. Yeah, yeah. We just see you man left me, and I'm, but in my head I'm thinking, bro, it's been twenty minutes. Yeah, yeah. He we, we deserved we, to we, be. We, we, we all said like go shower, and then meet back, and we most people did that, and then left. We quite set quickly. a time as well. We always set a time. 
Yeah, we yeah. always said like, yeah. all right, at twenty past, we're leaving. I think him and Freezy for some reason, I think they shared each other's shower or something. So like they were something happened. Well, Freezy was in the RV, so Freezy used Josh's. Yeah, 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 yeah. But then I know they both did something that meant they were gonna have a shower later. Maybe they went in the pool or something. Yeah. So anyway, yeah. Then Josh just. Yeah, that was a, that was a good <laughs> moment. <laughs> yeah. Then we went back, got him. Then went back again. Yeah. yeah, he still made it, so it was it was fine. Yeah. yeah. But yeah, that's it for today. Um, sorry for us. That's been a good one. It's a good one. I reckon. Um, I'm so tired. Yeah, I'm gonna sleep. I, I, I gotta drive back now. Well, I'm not driving, but I'm in yeah. the car. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. But thanks, guys, for watching. <laughs> And we'll be back next week to talk about Simon Stag that's happening this next week. Yeah. Woo! He's just decided telepathically. Bye.